Well, today we have popcorn ball making taking place, and I have Luca with me today. Luca, by the way, is Luca Quinn, and he's the youngest son of our TV food editor. And you know lots about food, right? Yeah. So how many tablespoons of butter are in one stick of butter? Eight. Oh, you know that? Yeah. So we need two. I cut it off for you already. Please put that in your pot. Popcorn bowls are really easy to make, and Luca's been practicing in the kitchen, haven't you? Oh, you need a stool. Let me get you a stool. I keep the stool just for young men of your size. Is that better? Yeah. Okay, good. So stir up your butter. I have my butter already melted, and you're gonna add to the butter two tablespoons of light brown sugar. So throw in your sugar. Okay, so now, oh, marshmallows, half a bag of marshmallows. Stir those in. I'll stir mine in. We've divided one recipe in half. You can make the whole recipe, and we have lovely popcorn already popped. So look, what's happening to your marshmallows? It's getting Yeah, they're mushroom. melting beautifully. So we want them completely melted. And Luca asked to flavor his popcorn balls with a wonderful toffee bits, and I have wonderful dried cranberries in mine. I like the combination of the sweet and the sour. So how's that going? Oh, yours is almost ready. Keep stirring. We don't want the marshmallow or the butter or the brown sugar to burn. Yours is ready. You can throw in your popcorn first and stir. I think we'll turn off the heat. So really stir coating all that popcorn. And now you can throw in your toffee. And mine's ready now. Yum. So six cups of freshly popped popcorn. And it's really important to pop the best popcorn that you can find. And a half a cup of toffee bits in one pot and a half a cup of dried cranberries in the other pot. So hold your pot with a pot holder and see how I'm stirring? Really with a lot of elbow grease. And I think mine are ready to roll into balls. How are yours? Hard. <laughs> oh, come on. Are you tired? No. No, that's perfect. Okay. I think you got it just right. But this will make it into nice balls. Now, how many balls is it supposed to make? Four. Four balls. I'm going to put some butter on your hands. So rub those together. It's good to put this so that you don't get all sticky. This is important. Now, this is hot, so be careful. How big do you want your popcorn balls? That's the question. There. Oh, boy, do those look good. Nice and solid and yet light and crunchy. So this is a project that you must supervise with your children. And then you can just wrap up these in cellophane and you can take these to school and give them to all your friends. Yeah. Okay, wanna try this one? Uh, sure. Mm, you try that and I'll try this. Mm hmm. What do you think? It's good. It is very good. So Luca, you've been very good at making popcorn balls. How about making, say, monkey bread with me later on? Yeah. Yeah? Do you know what monkey bread is? It's like um, like that dough that's like made into balls, and then you like put it into... Um, it's a very good idea what monkey bread is. You put it into... Um, Stay like, tuned. Like a whole thing. <laughs>